A lot of people are paying attention to the tally. Hospitals, the county commissioners, first responders here at the Public Safety Center. And as the number of people suffering from coronavirus nears 100 people in Lancaster County, we asked County Commissioner Josh Parsons about the county's response. Parsons says he's pleased with the way people in Lancaster County have socially distanced themselves over the last two weeks. Traffic seems lighter, shops are closed. But despite all the mitigation efforts, the number of positive COVID-19 cases jumped more than 30 in a day. Parsons says part of the reason for that spike was a backlog of tests. Health systems tell the county they are working through the backlog now, processing the tests and speeding up the way they do it. So more tests means more positives. We're doing the best we can. Um, obviously, you know, we're going to continue to monitor it. People have every single person is concerned for health, for their livelihood. This is a very tough time, but, you know, this community is very, very strong. It's very resilient, so I'm confident that, you know, we'll be all right. We'll come through this together. Parsons is also concerned about the large number of nursing homes and retirement communities here in the county. Five nursing homes already have a positive COVID case. So he says keeping those nursing facilities on lockdown will be important in the weeks to come. In Lancaster County, I'm Meredith Jorgensen, WGAL News 8.